the genomic journey started with understanding the structure of DNA. In the King's archive, they've got photograph 51, probably the, the most important photograph of the 20th century. It showed that DNA was, in fact, a helix. There's been an explosion of genetics and genomics in the last 20 years. It's been very, very exciting. The attraction of what we do in our field is we're combining both this very exciting, fast-moving, hard science with the art of caring and the art of helping families. Helping people understand their condition, but also understand the emotional effects that that condition has on individual family members. If families aren't helped to use that information, you can often see disruptions and fractures in family relationships and, and the problems that that causes long term, let alone the effect it has on their relationships and their psychological well-being. We're at a period of time where genetics and genomics will be spreading out across the health service. Nurses and other allied health professionals are more and more going to be facing families who have genetic disorders in their everyday practice. It's a great privilege being able to merge the actual real world cold face of working in NHS seeing these families with the academic world of thinking about how we can make things better for them essentially. Actually when you meet families you just realise it makes such a huge difference to them and there's just so much opportunity at King's. The possibilities are just endless and, and that's what makes it academically so exciting to be here.